Hey guys, Mr. Moki Moki here. I got my Evil Hero deck for you today. And um, I'm going to show you guys how evil it truly is. So uh, without any further ado, I'll get started. First up in the deck is my uh, Elemental Hero Stratos. Yeah, you pretty much have to run it now. I love him. If I could run three, I would. I would marry him. That's kind of gay, but it's okay. And then uh, next up is my Elemental Hero Prisma. And he's good for, like, fusion and stuff, which is basically what this deck is all about. And then we got, uh, two Evil Hero Malicious Edge. He's a piercer, and, uh, with Infernal Prodigy, he's pretty much easy to get out. Plus, his fusion is great. I love it. He's sexy. And next up is, uh, Evil Hero Infernal Prodigy. If you tribute him, you, with, uh, with a fiend type, at the end of the phase you get to draw one, which is really good speed. And then uh, next up, two Evil Hero Infernal Gainers. Helps with, like, double attack for your fiends. So, yeah. He's, his effect really doesn't really come in handy a lot, but I like to run two anyway. Um, next up, two Avion. Um, I guess he's okay, because he fuses with a lot, so that's why I run two. Um, and then two Burstinatrix. It's the same thing. You just have to run two. Uh, two Wild Heart, same thing. He's not affected by traps, he's fine. And two Clayman, because he fuses two times. And then one Sparkman, because just Lightning Golem. That's it. And then moving on, the rock types that I have are Giant Soldier of Stone. Now, I'm pretty sure there's better rock types up there, but I like, I like Giant Soldier of Stone just because he's a good wall. And, um... He's old. He's old school, and I like him. So, and and then we got we get move on to the real evil monsters, which is Blackwing Gale the Whirlwind. I run him because he's pretty bitch, and a tuner, my only tuner. Uh, Neo Spacian Grand Mole. He's also a big bitch. Everybody in the world fears his Grand Moliness from space. Yeah, and then we got Gorzy doing Gorzy things and being a fiend. Moving on to the spells, we got uh, Double Dark Fusion. It's nice. Can't be targeted by uh, spells, traps, monster effects for the turn. Very nice. And then Dark Calling uh, from from the hand or the graveyard, which is quick, and I like it. So two of those. Uh, next up for Search Power, we got E Emergency Call and Gold Sarcophagus. Gold Sarcophagus just to search out maybe Dark Calling or Dark Fusion. E Emergency Call to search out your monsters. And then we got uh, One Foolish. Maybe just to uh, se send some monsters to the graveyard for Dark Calling. Then we got One Book. I would love to one three, but uh, One Book's fine for now, I guess. Uh, next, cards that are really evil in this meta. Dark Hall, Monster Reborn. Giant Grenade and Cold Wave. So, yeah, great. Love them. Next up in the traps, we got uh, Magic Cylinder and Negate Attack, just for stall, I guess, because uh, this deck kind of needs some stall power. And then moving on to the staple traps, we got uh, Mirror Force, Torrential, Bottomless. Yeah, it's, it's nice. It works for this, works for this deck build. Next up, we got uh, for the two final traps, one seven tools, one traps done. It's fine, works well. And uh, moving on to the extra deck, I gotta say um, my two evil hero uh, dark Gaias. They're good, especially uh, they become high beat sticks. I like them, and uh, they just terrorize everybody. Next up, we got uh, one hero malicious uh, fiend. 35 beater, um, pretty much your opponent doesn't want to enter their battle phase when this guy's, this guy's out, so he's perfect. And then we got, uh, one in Evil Hero Infernal Wing, it's fine, destroys, uh, gets some life point damage on your opponent, it's very good. And then we got Infernal Wild Cyclone, I love him, I loves me some Wild Cyclone. He, uh, you, what's, what's there to say about this guy? He, like, when he attacks, you, your opponent can't activate any spells or traps. 
and when he does battle damage, the whole back row of, the, of your opponent's spell and trap cards are gone. It's just, it's just beautiful. Next up, we got an Evil Hero Infernal Sniper, a good wall, and 1,000 every of your standby phases. So if you can stall your opponent out for 8 turns, that's game. And then, uh, this is pretty much a proxied Lightning Golem. So I just put Thunder Giant in there, just because eh, they're like the counterparts of each other. So, uh, Lightning Golem, yeah, once per turn you can destroy one monster on the field, which is pretty fucking good. Like, yeah, that strikes terror into my eyes. And then, just for Synchros, I just have Stardust and Gaia. Um, I'm trying to find a level 7 tuner, uh, just for Synchroing. I know this, this deck really isn't Synchro friendly, but uh, with Gale I figured might as well. Don't really have much in this extra deck anyway. Moving on to the side deck. Um, Dark Armed, because he's evil, and he strikes terror into children's eyes. And, uh, yeah, I love it. And then for just dark support, since I only have like three darks in the deck. Sangan for search, Necro Gardener for protection. Hey, they're nice, good darks. Um, then we got into the spells of my side deck. To my bodies. So, yeah, good protection. It's nice. Uh, this one I just put in for fun. Enemy controller. It's kind of like your book, but meh. Uh, Nobleman of Cross Out because everybody is just running my Raikou. And uh, I hate me some Raikou. Alright? And this card's good. Uh, one Ryoku just for power if you're ever facing high beaters for some reason. And then uh, we got one Smashing Ground, if we ever have some high defense that we need to get around. And then moving on to the traps, we got uh, two Shadow Imprisoning Mirror and two Light Imprisoning Mirror. And uh, pretty much I added Shadow Imprisoning Mirror because uh, Black, Wings, Black Wings scare the fucking shit out of me. And then Light Imprisoning Mirror because you know what, if Light Swarms make a comeback, I hate them. I just hate light swarms with a burning passion. So, got that. And then finally we got a royal oppression just for fun, and threatening roar just for stall. So, uh, that's it guys, that's my evil hero deck. Uh, if you have any suggestions for it, leave uh, comments in the comment section below, in my crotch. And, uh, have a nice day. Peace out.